This short animation gives you an overview of what's in this month's team brief, which is available now on TIS and in the My ICFT smartphone app. Before I begin, I'd like to say a Happy New Year to all of our colleagues at the hospital and in our local community. As you'd expect, winter pressures at this time of year are at their height, with increased demand on all of our services. I want to thank colleagues for their continued hard work and dedication during this very busy time. 2020 is International Year of the Nurse and the Midwife. We as a trust will be celebrating each month with a series of events to coincide with the 200th anniversary of the birth of Florence Nightingale. Take a look at the team brief and on social media for more details. We will see lots of activity this year as NHS trusts align themselves to the long-term NHS plan. In this month's team brief, I talk about what we are doing in the community with our neighbourhood pharmacists and physiotherapists. There's some great work planned, so I would encourage you to take a look at that. As it's January and the start of the new year, we're all looking at how we can make improvements to our health and well-being. We've got dry January and new for this year, we've got a campaign called That Counts. Take a look at Team Brief for information on how the small things you do all count to making 2020 a fitter and healthier year for you. Towards the end of 2019, we launched our Scanner Appeal. So far, we've got 37,000 in the bank, but that's just a start. 2020 will be the year where we make great strides to achieving our goal of £1 million for our new scanner. Take a look at Team Brief for details on how you can help raise funds. I'm delighted for the first time we've reached over 79% of our patient-facing staff vaccinated against flu. That's fantastic and I think we can do better still. I've put a short article in Team Brief about how you can help us to get over 80%. Let's see how we can do this this year. Finally, this month's Team Brief, as usual, contains details about our performance as an NHS trust, both from a quality perspective and a financial one. Whilst NE remains a challenge for all trusts, we are one of, if not only, trusts still meeting our council waiting times and a number of other important national measures. Financially, we still need to keep looking at opportunities to save and do what we can to be as efficient as possible. All the details about this and everything else I have told you about in this short video can be found in this month's team brief. So take a look today. See you next month.